Hi everybody, it's that time again for an oh yeah, oh no, product review. Today we're doing the Hamilton Beach Flex Brew two-way coffee brewer. I tell you, right off the back, here's the box. It exactly shows you exactly what you're getting. A coffee pot and a coffee K-cup brewer. It shows you on the front, there's the K-cup to let you know that's if you want to make these cups of coffee, you need the K-cup. It shows you exactly. On the back, it gives you in fine detail, coffee, grinds in your uh, brewing for uh, putting your coffee in, it shows you exactly where your water goes, and it shows you pouring it. It's Tells you these things in different languages, so if you're not an English speaker, you have the K-cup and a brewer. You have where it's also showing on the K-cup side where you pour your water in. And then you have a storage spot, okay, which is also explanatory to let you see that it's given to you. It shows you the features of everything that's going on into the uh, coffee pot and what's doing. And explains it in different languages also. Your timer and everything. All right, now let's turn this back around. Yeah. Here is your coffee pot. This coffee pot holds 12 ounces of water. I've brewed it to the top. I like a big cup of coffee. So if I like a big cup of coffee, my cup mug's not that small. So if you see, it holds four and a half of these in water. So it, you're going to get your you're going to get your size out of there. That that should hold you for a good time. Here's the cup that's actually on the thing. This holds at least seven. So that's a good amount also throughout your day. Now you open it up. Like I said, it's not small. You open it up. Here's your there's your grind holder. Here's where you pour your water. Quick and simple and easy. On the K cup side, there's your water part right there. You pour your water in and you're great. Now, let me just show you how easy and simple the, the system works. All you do, if you want to set your timer, you press the button and it just, and it just, sorry, and it just goes. You don't have to sit there and hold it. And if you notice it, look at the side there, where it's popping back and forth from AM to PM, easily. See, AM to PM easily. And it doesn't have to worry about it. Now, once it sets itself on that side, it goes the other. All you have to do is press that and you can, bam, and it's done. Now, after that, you have right here your coffee, now watch when you press that, look at the coffee just pop right up. So if you go back and forth between these two, there's your K-cup, it shows you a tall cup and a small cup. There's your coffee. There's your K-cup. Very simple. It's only got two things, but it's making it simple for you to understand. This is your program to set your timer in the morning for when you want to sit up here and say, I get up at four, I get up at 10, I get up at 12, whatever. This is here for the coffee side, you hit that, there's your bowl. If you want strong coffee, you hit that, it'll brew it strongly. Now, when you hit the K-cup, up here it has the same thing. How do you want it brewed? If you want it bold and strong, you hit that, it'll hit it strong. If you hit it regular, there's regular, okay? There's your timer still again. Now, let's, let's do this again. Now, I'm backing up a little bit just so you can see, okay? But here, is the beauty of it. There's your K-cup. That K-cup right there, you can make, you can buy any different flavor you want. And most of the cups always fits this. Okay, that, that's, that's these K-cups. Now, the thing that I like about it is, let me back this up just a little bit, so you can see this. You take this off. This is the guard just to say you don't make any uh, mess. That's a little guard area just to keep you from spilling the water all over the floor or anything. This is what's beautiful for me. This is a regular brewer, like making espresso. 
And just to show you something, I go to my favorite shops in the morning, and this is what I look for, shop coffee. It's strong, because I like my coffee strong. Now, I pay $1.37, sometimes $1.50, $1.60 for a cup of coffee. If you're telling me now that I have this, and I can make my coffee in the morning the way I want to, and I've got my shock, and I pour that in there, and I put it on bowl, I'm getting me some coffee. It's the way I want it. So that's what I like. If you can tell me I can put this in here and close it down, put my shock coffee in there, move this out the way, put my own cup of coffee in here, and I'm good. I'm good. And I'm walking out the house smiling because I've just drank the coffee that I made that I know how strong I want it. Once you get to understand how to brew it, you know what I mean? You're going to learn very quickly how to make it. That's where you're doing it. So overall, between not have to fight with somebody on the coffee on what to make in the pot, whether they like it weak or strong, I can make my own. And that's a great thing. So overall, on the box, I give the box a 10 for its advertising because it did it in the right way. It showed you everything, explains it in different languages, good. I give them a 10 on the coffee because the coffee goes out well and does it right. right. I give them a 10 and a half to 11 on the brew side because guess what? Now you can be yourself when it comes to coffee. So overall, I give this an oh yeah, that's some good coffee that you can wake up to in the morning. Until next time, tell me if you like it, subscribe if you want to. Thank you, and until next time.